How do you tell a bunch of humans they're going the wrong way? Might be in a group. And the direction isn't necessarily a physical direction. It's a strategy. It's a strategy that is trying to accomplish the mission or the goal of whatever the group is together for. And yet, you know, you know that their strategy, their process, the way they're going about things is not going to get them that goal. They're not going to achieve it. And so, if you see this, you're outside the group or you see this and you're inside the group, two very different things. So, how do you bridge that gap? How do you get their attention? not lose rapport and get them going in the direction that you feel they need to go. So I use maps. I use maps to show people where they are, to show people where I think they're going, and then show them where I think they're going to end up. A lot of times people don't like that either. A conceptual map can be a beautiful thing. It's an ideal. It's the way you want things to be, but not necessarily the way things are. The map is not the territory. So if you're using a map to guide yourself, it's very different from using a map to guide everybody. Everyone has to agree to the map, and maybe some of them don't want to. People have their own maps. People have their own ways of seeing the world. People may not want to look at your map or my map and go, okay, we're going to use that map. We're going to follow that map, even though we don't really understand the map which means we have to learn from the person who drew the map. So let's say I take your map, I cut it up, I get all the pieces, and then I reorganize them and I put them into a different structure. Do you think you'll want to use the map? Or would you have to admit maybe that your map was wrong?